Now I'm gonna show you foot lock. <laughs> because that's the way I do it. Two ascenders. Now you can get your ascender shorter so you don't have to hold yourself with your arms. But your foot lock. You just put two ascenders on. And you're gonna put one leg up with the rope passing right over your foot. Now I'm gonna bring my feet up, up here. I'm gonna lock the rope. I can sit here a long time on a locked rope. Just practice that. Have the foot right up here. And lock the rope. Now to make this easy, get a short strap. Make a short strap. So you can sit on it. See, I can just sit on it. And then I have my ascenders up here where I would normally have them. Within reach. Now I can just sit. Now I don't have to hold myself and I can just practice locking my feet. And do that again and again and again. And then you can practice standing up and sit back down and practice standing up and sit back down and practice standing up and sit back down. But first, do this many times. Locking the rope. Locking the rope. Stand up. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. So that's how you start to practice foot lock. Get a short strap. You can cut one of these straps in half, like this, hook it on both sides, and then just sit on that and practice locking your feet. Because the foot lock, what people do is they, they don't get a good lock and it, the rope is slipping through their feet and then they're holding themselves with their arms and they're getting tired. <laughs> Just have a short strap and sit and practice locking your feet so that when you actually try to climb, you'll get the lock and you can stand up and you're not using your arms so much. So that's lesson one.